across last week. Nothing major. Was beaten clearly, but still ran quite well. The run was quite respectable. Winlock at large, who comes up as the late male, uh, has run some nice races here in the straight. Never missed a place from three goes. It's had a little freshen up. Starting to load away now. Track being cleared. So spinning Pixie, the favourite box two. And the green light goes on. The set. Ready now. Away, spinning pixie began okay, but then copped a bump there as Ariel Coaster wanted to get down to the inside, so he's in a bit of strife. In the meantime, out wide showing good speed. Winlock at large, Aston Simpton is there as well, putting in the big strides now. Oh, it's got very tight to the finish. Uh, Winlock at large has beaten Sheath Rover, spinning pixie, and Aston Simpkin. And the result looked like it was going to be a little bit different before then. Aqua Panther has finished behind those. And Ariel Coaster at the tail end of the field. The run was around about 17.10. Just a major bump with about 50 metres to go, I suppose. Changed the complexion of the race. There was about three or four winning chances before that. Winlock at large was in front. And uh, then copped a little bit of a bump but still rode it well and does get home. 7125. 7125. The judges' numbers. Seven, one, two, and five after race two on the program. She's forever has run well with her first straight track run. Used box one quite well, was sneaking up on the inside and got pretty close. And Spinning Pixie copped a little bump at a vital stage and, and has cost her in particular. Got squeezed up against the rail right near the line. So she was a bit unlucky not to finish closer as well. Ahead by three quarters with the margins. Ahead by three quarters. Seven, one, two, and five. The judges' numbers, we've got the all clear. 17, 12 was the gallop. 17, 12 with a 452 and a 10, 75. With the early splits, 17, 12 was the run. Ahead by three quarters, we do have the all clear on seven, one, two, and five. 17.12 the time, 4.52, 10.75, and the run home was 6.41, 6.41, not a super quick run home, but there was a bit of bumping going on over the concluding stages, which added to that slower last section. But Ed Kowalski gets Winlock at large at home, it's been very consistent, and has a freshen up, and keeps its head in front here today.